different types of alligators. There's the American one, and then there is a, another type that does live in Asia. But this is one of the most common uh, reptiles, alligators, that you can find living right around us. What's up here? Hey, Austin, how is that cool? Yeah. yeah. Do you think he'd make a good pet? No, they don't make good pets at all. Because he may be small now, but he will grow very, very quickly. You don't want to push too hard. Do you want to take, do you want to, we can't take them home? No, even though they are legal pets here in Pennsylvania, they make absolutely awful pets. Because one, there's no such thing as a nice alligator. Yeah. And two, they never ever stop growing. Right. And the largest one was almost 18 feet long. And then he may come up, come up through the toilet. Yes, you know. Me. And there was a movie once and that happened. Anyway, Patrick, what else do we have? It's going to spray you. You think if I turn tail and spray, anything's going to happen? No. All right. No. Lift, lift the tail up, Gia. Watch right. out. Here it comes. It's going to spray you. No. <laughs> well, you never have anything to worry about with skunks here in Zoom America because all of our skunks are descended. They don't have any of that nasty, stinky, smelly, skunky stuff that we are all used to smelling. Gia, I would never be able to go Gia, home. Do you think Gabe smells worse than the skunk? <laughs> <laughs> Well, even though she is descended, she still has a little bit of a body odor. Oh. So, and we haven't quite found a weasel deodorant that works. <laughs> now, we, they'll snap, right? Will they snap? Yeah, she does have the ability to bite, and it does hurt a lot because they have such great senses of smell, but very poor eyesight. Well, by all means, let me put my damaged can here. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, back to America.